A South Florida family heartbroken after a child tragedy. Two young girls drown in a canal. Their father speaking today. And Seven's Brandon Beyer is live at this scene in Margate. Brandon? Al Belkis, it has been nonstop traffic at this family's home in Margate. Folks bringing baskets. The latest lady bringing a basket of food for this family after this heartbreaking story. The family of four-year-old Ludlene and two-year-old Lujeda Luima look over the fence into the canal where the sisters drowned Tuesday night. No one's quite sure how the little girls managed to get out of this backyard and into the water. The father says he keeps this gate closed and locked at all times and never leaves the girls alone. Never, 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 never. I don't know what happened yesterday. And then me inside, I don't know what happened. God. One. The family says the father stepped away for just a moment Tuesday to get a glass of water. And in an instant, the girls were out of sight. The father called 911. A massive search began. Police and fire, divers and boats. But when the girls were found, it was too late. The family devastated. <laughs> Family members say the girls were active. The mother says they like to ride bikes and were always playing together. Maybe that's what they thought they were doing when they somehow found their way on the other side of this fence and into the murky waters of this canal. Official word from police is that this drowning remains under investigation. Meanwhile, we can tell you the family says they're having difficulty coming up with funds to pay for not one but two funerals. If you'd like to help, we've linked some information on our website, WSBN.com. We're live in Margate, Brandon Byer, 7 News.